what's the biggest barrier that you see to someone wanting to get started using the bag? Well, it's a different look. So it's not a normal look that you see in the gym. So it's obviously like, who knows, is that, is that cool? Like, am I, am I gonna look cool doing that, you know? <laughs> so I think you just have to like, separate that out and look at the bigger picture. We're moving forward in fitness. We're progressing. We're, we're utilizing every plane of motion when we train with the bag. The Bulgarian bag is an awesome piece of equipment uh, because it's just such great bang for your buck. And it's one of those things that just about everybody should have because um, it just makes you flow so much through movement and makes you just so much more graceful. And then going through this class today was uh, amazing because it was just this step-by-step -step logical progression, um, enough time for you to practice the moves, intelligently understand them, physically get to know them um, before moving on to the next progression of the move and, and the way that everything was described and just kind of presented to you um, not only made you feel really comfortable with the material but also really sort of like excited to use the product and now uh, I've had this waiting for me uh, for a week and I haven't really picked it up that much my bag's sitting at home and now I just can't wait I'm gonna get home and I'll, I'll have my first 10,000 reps in, in a month I know it so super stoked. When we come in, we really want to get to know the people who who are attending the course. So we have introductions. We really like dig into who they are. We want to know right off the bat, like what we're what we're going to walk into and how we're going to show them how Supless is going to work for them. You know, so the introduction is great. And then from there, we go into the elements. We want to show them exactly what they're getting into, who we are, what the bag is. Let's take you know something common like a Bulgarian bag and a sandbag. What exactly makes the Bulgarian bag's construction and how you use it different from some of the other tools out there? With our bag, the way it's shaped, the handles, the side handles, the strap handles, it mimics so many tools and we can do pretty much all of those exercises that other tools can do, such as the kettlebell, uh, the barbell, the dumbbell, the weight vest, the medicine ball. Like all of these tools are wrapped up and all in one in the, in the Bulgarian bag. I've learned so much. I know I can deliver this to clients in my personal training gym. Um, I could do this at home. I can do any exercise I'd like to with this. There is no other workout equipment like this and I 100% suggest you go to the certification course. You know, I've done a lot of certifications over the years mm -hmm. and people remember how they felt coming to a course. Yeah. The curriculum is absolutely sure. You can't have poor curriculum, you can't have poor instructors, yeah. but people more than anything, even more than the education, remember how they feel. So yeah. as a coach, it means so much to me to have people smiling when they leave. That's what Yvonne has brings to every training. He's a hard coach, he's, he's real, he's legit, he's gonna get you results, and he does break you down sometimes, but in the end, when you walk out of the gym, every single time, you walk out with your head up because he just builds you back up, and that's the same thing that we bring to our course. Mike and Bridget did a fantastic job. I've been tinkering around with a 26 pound bag in my garage for about a year, but nothing compares to the one-on-one -on -one instruction that I got today. And now I, I feel like I know what I'm doing. We have a few other things go into the protocol workout, which is your pass or fail uh, workout. Um, it's not a big deal. We want you focusing on the education throughout the day so you can send a video later, uh, but it's such a fun part of the course. It's so, exciting they are so they work their butts off like it is something where they actually get to feel all the movements that they just learned and what it's capable of doing you know going back to just this idea of how Yvonne's created the curriculum as well as the training protocols yeah I just think just observing the students team up together mm -hmm. gather around each other push each other Ugh. encourage each other that's our gym and that's, that's soupless. And to share that that's through the share. curriculum is, yeah. you know, there's one thing to talk about, you know, selling a bag. Mm -hmm. And it's a fantastic piece of equipment and we both appreciate it. Yeah. But it's something when the bag is accompanied by amazing education that's really, as a coach, it means so much to me when someone takes the, the time to design something that is created around learning. Yeah. And so it's a learn by doing model. It so is. like these people today put in some work oh yeah they did <laughs> like, and they did amazing and they loved it i think they would have asked for more if we could have <laughs> given it to them like i know they were physically tired but i think emotionally like i think they just they, they fell in love with it they fell in love with it